All right, we begin today at 5 with hope for new life in part of Cleveland. Demolition started at Irish Town Bend today. That sits between the Cuyahoga River and West 25th Street in Ohio City. This is the first step towards creating a new metro park space that will connect trails from Cuyahoga Valley National Park all the way to Lake Erie. Brandon Simmons spent the day following this story. Brandon, this is no small task. Yeah, no, not simple at all. You would think creating a park full of green space would be easy. You just plant some grass seed, right? Tear stuff down. But there's a lot more to it than you think. This land is basically sliding toward the river and will need some serious engineering magic in order to fix that. Now, Land Studios, the nonprofit organization, is partnering with the Metro Parks to turn it into a 23-acre park that would extend from the sidewalk of West 25th Street all the way to the river's edge. But first, of course, they had to get rid of the buildings at the top end of that hillside. Now, another problem they have to deal with, the land is sliding down toward the river, and the Port Authority is working on a plan that will likely cost tens of millions of dollars to shore up that hillside so that this project that the Metro Park wants to do can move forward in the coming years. Now, one, one thing it has done, planners say it will be a hub that uh, Greater Cleveland's trail system will be uh, enjoyed by everyone. You're gonna have like five regional trails that will all come right here. You'll be able to go down to the National Park here, get to Edgewater and Lake Erie from here. Sort of a Grand Central Station of trails within itself. Now this is indeed the final piece of the Lake Link Trail that is years in the making. Northeast Ohio's park system, of course, is one of the top in the country. And this would be the icing on the cake, so to speak, when it's all finished. Now this is just step one, of course, Jay. The project will take years to complete and it's most likely dependent on how quickly the port can get that hillside stabilized. But as you can see, the project is headed in the right direction so far. Yeah, it certainly is. Green space near downtown is never a bad idea. That will take one massive retaining wall, but I'm betting they make it beautiful. Brandon Simmons, thank you very much. We appreciate it.